very same scenario, very same situation. So now, this is where I come and I talk to you about the very same thing. I'm going to make a short story. Basically, this short story is about a man who was a mathematician and he was well known in his community for being that mathematician. He had a son and now the people started to wonder, is the son as clever as the father? Now, the neighbor came and approached the son in the absence of the father and said, I have with me a 10 rand note and a 5 rand coin, so which one would you want to choose? And the boy took the 5 rand coin and left. Obviously, the man said, no, he's not in the same standard as his father. Then he came again the following day and said, I have with me the very same 10 rand note and a 5 rand coin. Which one would you go for? And he went for the 5 rand coin. This continued to happen time and time again. Until the news got to the father that your son keeps on taking the 5 rand coin instead of the 10 rand note. So he said, son, why do you keep on going for the 5 rand coin when you know very much, very well that the 10 rand coin is much more better? Then the son said, dad, the very same day that I start taking the 10 rand note, that's when the game will stop. So for the sake of the game, I need to continue taking the 5 rand coin. Oh, so now what I'm saying is, the mind can be easily fooled. What I'm also challenging you to do is to be the person that fools a mind. Be the person that is different. Be the person that goes for what is not expected. Be the person that will see the silver lining. It's very difficult for people to identify the silver lining or to see a positive thing out of a bad scenario. Two children raised by the same father who was a drunkard. One turns out to be a success in life, becomes a lawyer. The one turns out to be a drunkard as well, like the father. Newspapers have an interest in the uh, nurturing of these two children. Then, this is how the newspaper read. As they interviewed the two, they say, why did you turn out like your father to become a drunkard? And the response was, with a father like mine, what was I supposed to turn out to be? And then when they, introduced, when they interviewed the lawyer, he says, with a father like mine, I had to, do be, I had to be different. Same scenario, but different turn of events. So now, I was talking to you in general. Basically, you're thinking what I'm talking is general motivation. I'm not talking to you. Well, I've got news for you. I am not talking to you. I'm only talking to your dreams, to your visions, to your goals, because those are very much alive.